There have been 851 episodes of Doctor Who broadcast to date. Our mission? For every single one, say something nice. Hello dear viewers and welcome back. It's the end of another week of Say Something Nice and we're not actually moving that far off from yesterday. It's The Smugglers, Episode 4. So I've talked about The Smugglers before and pretty much the Doctor's plan to give the villain what he wants so that he doesn't kill anyone. However, here, the Doctor does just that. He helps Pike find the treasure, but in doing so, delays him just long enough for Blake's men to arrive and arrest the pirates. However, the moment I'm going to pick from this is the character of the Squire, specifically his realisation that while he may be a smuggler himself, he's no killer, and so he turns on Pike, and the Doctor saves his life. So in the middle of a pitch battle, the Doctor runs in to check that the Squire, who's been shot, is going to survive. And when he realises that's the case, he does what he said he was going to do. He and Ben escape back to the TARDIS, where Polly is waiting for them, but only after making sure that the Squire is going to get the medical attention that he needs. It shows the evolution of the First Doctor's character very early on, all he ever wants to do is get back to the TARDIS and get out of the situations he finds himself in. But over the course of the first year of Doctor Who, he became a more heroic figure who would stand up against injustice. And here, right at the end of his tenure, we have an example of, even though he wants justice and he wants as many people to survive as possible, and he will take action to ensure that happens, he also <laughs> wants to slip away quietly and unnoticed and not have to answer any awkward questions. And just that tension of the character, exemplified in him checking on the Squire, is something really nice about The Smugglers Episode 4. I'll be back over the weekend with a rapid randomizer review, so I'll see you then, and thank you very much for watching.